you know, having been in an Oscar winning movie called West Bank Story, I remember when the movie won in 2007, I was getting a lot of recognition and people would just say, hey, you're great in the movie. As an actor, you sort of feel like, whoa, I'm better than everybody else. And people wanted to take pictures with me after the show and, you know, sign autographs, which I wasn't used to, but I liked it for the little time that it lasted. I'm at a mall and I was about to go get coffee. I shaved my head for a new movie and I had a bigger belly than this, if you can imagine. <laughs> I mean, in my younger days, I had a six pack. Now it looks like an airbag. <laughs> So I had this big airbag of a belly and I had shaved my head and I was wearing a green shirt. As I'm going to get coffee, a kid grabs my leg and then I turn around and I go like, hi. And the kid is going, I love you. And I said, well, I love you too. What can I do for you? And this little kid, Kevin, said, can I take a picture with you? And I'm thinking, damn, my fan base is getting younger and younger. <laughs> So the mother took five pictures of us. Afterwards, when I wanted to say goodbye, I said, well, what are you going to do with these pictures? He said, I'm going to take it to my school and show it to my friends, and I tell them that I met Shrek. <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, kids always tell the truth. So that was the motivation for me to lose some weight. You know, I used to get stared at a lot after our movie West Bank Story won the Academy Award. But one day I was in, in a grocery store and a guy comes up to me. He says, uh, excuse me, I don't mean to bother you, but has anyone ever told you that you look like that fat Iranian comedian? And I said, uh, what's his name? He said, he's got this terrorist name, Islam. And I said, no sir, I, no one has ever said that to me. <laughs> Since I was talking about a big belly <laughs> and being mistaken for Shrek, I have to tell you, I've lost 40 pounds. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. It took me 32 years, but I... <laughs> being from Iran, we are Aryans. We are like the Germans. We used to have colored eyes, blue and green. But since the Arab race came to spread Islam with the force of the swords, <laughs> they raped our language, our women, our soil, and our culture. So a lot of us Iranians are hairy. I, for instance, I have so much hair that when I go to the zoo, the gorillas in the cage look at me. They're so confused, like, mm -hmm. <laughs> how did you get out? I'm so hairy that one time I had to do a movie and they wanted to, to wax the hair. Poor wax lady, after two hours, she said, Sir, excuse me, can I take a half hour break? 